Hey guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here. Today I'm just going to show you a quick and easy way to add non-Steam games and applications to Steam for easy access. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to do is open up Steam and we're going to go to your library. And you can go ahead and click on games if it doesn't open up your library automatically. And we'll see something similar to this. If you're in the uh, list view, or the detail view I should say, it'll look like this. If you're in the list view, you might have some icons. And if you go to the grid view, you'll just see the icons themselves. So um, we'll start off in details view. And all you have to do is click on add game, just like if you were to activate a Steam key. But you're going to go to add a non-Steam game. And this is going to search your computer for other um, applications and games, basically anything that's an executable, and try and give you some hints as to what you want to add. If you can't find it here, you can always just click on Browse and um, bring up your Explorer menu to find uh, any game you want to add in there. But um, in this case, we're just going to choose Photoshop because that's an easy one to go ahead and, and just add in for easy access. So we'll add selected programs. And we'll see that Adobe Photoshop CC shows up right here, right? That's awesome. But what happens if we go into our detail view? We have this little tiny icon. And we have an even smaller one in this large icon list. And that doesn't look too good. Uh, so you can actually update that. And I just did a quick search in this case for um, Adobe Photoshop Steam icon. And I found one that's properly sized. And if this is any indication, I believe the size is um, 460 by 215 pixels. But um, it just means it's, it's this little square right here. This one right here was created by Dan Spy1994 on DeviantArt. Thanks, Dan. Uh, shout out. Go check him out on DeviantArt. And, you know, I'm not sure what kind of other stuff he does, but check it out. So um, we'll go ahead and save this image to our desktop. And then you'll go ahead and go to your um, Steam again. Right click on Adobe Photoshop and go to Set Custom Image. And now you can browse to your desktop. Find that image. I believe this one was a PNG. And if it's a JPEG, you'll have to click on JPEG, um, depending on the, the file extension. So it won't just have all images here. You might have to look it up. Um, it only works in JPEG, JPEG, which is just another JPEG um, format. I mean, the same JPEG format, but another extension for it. Uh, .png files for um, portable network graphics and TGA images. So we're going to choose PNG because that's what we downloaded. And then um, find this image here. Set image. And there we go. Now it kind of blends in with the rest of your applications and games. And um, you just hit play and it'll open up like usual. All right, so thank you very much for watching this tutorial, and I hope that I hope this helped. All right, have a good day. Peace.